I bought it. I bought all those um, Target um, perfumes that the TikTok girlies was talking about. So let's let's talk about it. Okay, so this one is I am must. Now apparently this one got the girls in the and they said it smelled like Ariana Grande and Baccarat Rouge 540. So let's. I feel like everybody want to be like Baccarat. Okay, I definitely see what they're talking about. If you want to be bougie on the budget, go get it. The next one we have is Flower Bed. Now the girls on TikTok saying that this smells like flower bulb. So let's see. This definitely does not smell like flower bulb. For sure. This smells like apple juice from Zara, which is also a dupe for Chanel Chance. So I would say it kind of smells like Chanel Chance. Okay, so we have Sunforia. This smells like one of them Tom Ford scents. You know how Tom Ford is so strong. This is strong. So the next one we got is Magnetic Candy. Let's see. Mm -mm. This I won't say this is bad, but it smells like cotton candy. Okay, so the next one we got is Midnight Cafe. Let's see. Mm, I like this one. You can definitely smell like the patchouli. Kind of got like a little hint of jasmine. And next we have Jungle Centel. So people were saying that this is a dupe for Centel 33. I can agree. I can see the resemblance. I'm not sure if like it's like a dupe dupe exactly or whatever. But I could definitely see the resemblance. This smells like airy, like woodsy. Yeah. Next one we have is Before the Rainbow. This kind of smells like shampoo. It's kind of, it's real fresh, real airy. Um, Yeah, it kind of smells like fresh shampoo. So, I am done reviewing these. So, out of all out of all eight of these that I review, on top of the one that's on the way that supposedly is a dupe for Tom Ford Lost Cherry, I would probably not keep that anyway because I don't like the Tom Ford Lost Cherry. Out of all of these, I would probably keep the I Am Musk, the Midnight Cafe, and then the um, Flower Bed. 